Hey guys, John Vapor Honing Technologies here today. We're gonna to talk a little bit about CFM. One of the main key problems with operating a vapor honing machine, or for that fact, any blasting machine, is CFM and PSI. CFM stands for cubic feet per minute. What this inevitably means is how much volume or how much air do you have actually coming through your lines. So the smaller the line, the less CFM or the less flow. Think of it as a garden hose. The smaller the water hose, the, the less amount of water coming through. Same with air, it's all fluid dynamics here. The bigger the hose, the more volume of water or air coming through. Obviously you have to have a certain flow rate to achieve a certain PSI. Obviously PSI is really important in any blasting process, specifically vapor honing, because we give you certain parameters and certain specifications on setting this machine up. So if I tell you 120 PSI on the machine, obviously you're gonna need at least the high end of the CFM value that we give. So 20 to 25 CFM, you're gonna need on the high end to sustain that 120 PSI. The higher the pressure, the more CFM you need to maintain that pressure. So it's a really key point. These machines or any, any blasting machine will not work effectively if you do not have the correct CFM and PSI. A lot of people ask, well, what kind of compressor should I get? Well, there's a million different options out there for people. Um, I recommend Polar Air. It's made by Eaton Corporation. Really good, solid compressor. If you have more questions on CFM and PSI, we're here and we can help you. Again, that rule of thumb is three CFM per motor horsepower and you can get a really quick idea, especially if you're looking at a used compressor. But be very careful on used compressors because you do not know how long they've been running and how hard and how long each time they've been running because the duty cycle obviously directly affects the performance of the machine over its lifetime. So if you have questions, give us a call. We're here to help. Again, thanks for watching. Take care.